Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to talk about how to fix D3 D11 compatible GPU error which is happening for many of the users when they're trying to play the game like Fortnite and even the Valorant and many more games. So in this video we're going to talk about how we can fix this. So let's directly really get into this. So the first one is all about we have to go over here. We need to search for adjust over here like this and we'll be getting this particular option which is called adjust the appearance and performance of the windows click on this one right now we need to go over here in the advanced tab right now we go to over here in the change and we need to go over here in the custom size and here we have to give the initial size to the volume over here and to the maximum size while selecting the disk make sure that you select the disk based on where the game is installed for example if you're having an issue with the valorant and the valorant is installed on f then you have to select f and go to the custom size and give the value so in the initial size is 1024 and the maximum size is currently depends on the ram of a computer so we need a calculator to do this calculation so just go over here so right now the pc which i'm using right now is having 16 gb of ram so what i need to do is just type 1024 and i have to multiply it with 16 that's going to give me this particular value so i have to copy this value over here 16384 and we have to paste this value and once you go for ok and you have to set everything and you have to check with the game if still the issue is there next one is all about just go over here in the to start over here right click and navigate to the device manager and right now we need to go over here in the display adapters and expand this from here you have to select your graphics card right click and there is an option to disable this first disable this then you need to enable it back and you have to check and also you can try for updating the driver as well just go for update the driver go for browse my computer from here and click on this one and you need to update the driver as well once the driver is up to date you can try with the game and most probably the issue regarding this will be completely fixed i hope this quick video is helpful see you soon next video bye